Good evening. So we're having our fruit fest tonight, the second this week. The soursop is now soft to the touch, which is supposed to be ready. And the cacao is ready to be eaten. It was also when we got it, but we haven't been hungry enough since. And we have these rambutans here that, uh, yeah, they look like, they look kind of freaky, but they taste really good. So we've got those two. Uh, so while we're having our fruit fest, our little friend up there is having a fly fest. Yeah, coming back to you. Periodically, it'll catch and snatch one of these flies. Have a great feast. Uh, and the coquille frogs is what you hear, like, if you can hear it, which I'm sure you probably can. All around. They invaded Hawaii at some point recently, and, um, haven't really found any natural enemies, but the mongoose will eat them. It keeps the mongoose, mongoose alive, so that's a problem because the mongoose is also not a native species. But um, uh, as you can hear, the coquille frogs are doing quite well. And that's only in the males you're hearing, so you can imagine twice as many out there. So let's see what we can, what we can do here. Now, I've never eaten soursop, neither has Steve, so we're just going to kind of cut into this thing and see what we have going on. Voila. It looks a bit like a cherry moya, honestly. Huh? Yeah, yeah, it does. Yeah, a bit like a cherry moya, so we're going to dig into that baby. Okay. Let's see if we grab a spoon here. See what we get here. It's good. It's slightly tart edge, which probably is the sour part. The sop I'm not sure about, but certainly the sort of tart sour camera man. It's actually very good. Mm -hmm. It's like a cherry moya with a little citrus on it or something. Mm. So here's the rambutan. And uh, you can open them by just biting in and kind of getting it open, but in these days, of, we don't know if something's been sprayed or something, I'm not too keen on doing that, so it's easy to also just cut the end like a little bit and then you can get it going, and you just peel this stuff off, seems like a lot of work for very little, but um, I mean in terms of growing all that hair on it, I'm not sure what the story is with that, but Okay. They're sweet. Very sweet and juicy. Something that begs to be made into some kind of juice or dessert or something like that. They're very good. So, <clears throat> now we'll try to dig into the... Um, cacao, which we've never had before, once again. So the word was to get the thing open and eat the flesh inside and leave the seeds alone because unless you dry them and stuff, they're going to be too bitter. So I have no idea what I'm dealing with right now other than a cacao pod here. But there's definitely some protection going on here because this thing definitely has a certain Not the best knife, but it's good enough. Let's see if we can get it open. Not really. Careful. <laughs> okay, we're there now. There you have it. So that's your cacao inside. It's actually slimy. The edge. This is slimy, very slimy, sticky slimy, it's kind of like you could use it for glue almost. And it wipes off with some resistance, it's actually quite slimy, you could use it for glue things. So what she said she eats is this white stuff around the, the seed, but don't eat the seed because that would be too bitter. 
and the seed is what you can ask. There's a there's a cracked seed right here. The seed is what is the cacao bean, and that's what you would like dry and once it's dry, we tasted some at the market, they're quite nice. It's like dried and roasted or something, whatever he did to it. Then it's quite nice. So um but he said it'd be very bitter to eat it just like this. So we'll eat one of these seed pods and see what we think. Sweet. A little bit slimy, not really bad, but it's a little slimy. And sweet. Cool. The difference between this one and the soursop would be the you know, the tanginess of the soursop is not here, really. It's, it's going to be a lot of work to eat this thing. I can taste that right now with the way the seeds are behaving, but so far so good.